security. Generally, human security implies the security of all individual or people we can say. And human security primarily focuses on the protection of the individual or well-being of the individual. That means uh, all the individuals should live a secured life without any danger, violence, etc. Okay. And uh, according to to simplify it, human security implies freedom of all people from uh, hunger, freedom from fear, terror, or any kind of insecurity, social, political, economic, cultural, and so on. So, the main challenges in the global level here is, you know, which disturbs human security are global poverty, global health crisis, global illiteracy, global inequality, etc. And environmental, global environmental crisis is also a cause of human, uh, so it is also one challenge to the human security today. If we talk about the characteristics of human security, number one, human security uh, is people centric rather than state centric you must have to remember second it is multi-dimensional okay what it is multi-dimensional why because it is linking to health education welfare rights etc thirdly the third characteristic is that uh, by improving capability of individual it secures their basic needs and rights that means it human security deals with the basic needs and rights of the individual fourth point if you think about its characteristics it is an international concept human security is an international concept fifthly it is related to human development and welfare activities sixthly it deals about the protection of uh, human life because it is the main objective of human security so here in brief we have studied what is human security and what are the characteristics of human security okay thank you very much for watching please like and subscribe